everyone, how are you guys doing? It's your girl Twinty, and we are here, guys, for our prayer. And I would like to thank every single one of you guys who show up right now as this video is premiering or afterwards. At least we can realize that we need to seek God on this twin flame journey. In our lives, we need to seek God. We need to give God thanks. As much as we are asking for blessings, we are asking for goodness in our lives, we have to be able to give God thanks for those blessings, for those goodness, for stability, for wealth, for protection. And so we have to take at least five minutes out of our time the more often, the, the better to give God thanks. And that's why as a camp, I wanted to do this. So that we can have a place where we can come together as one, as a soul family. The family that prays together stays together. And that's because we will be on the same energy level because we want the same things we need the same things and we support each other 424 and through every one of us wanting the same thing we eventually get the same thing that we're asking for because the intention that we have is good intention and not only good intention for ourselves, but good intention for those around us. We are a family here in this Twin D camp. And that's the reason why I premiere all of my videos. Because I want everyone to come together as a camp. It's like a, it's like a, a bonfire. You light the fire and everyone sits around it and you warm up and you talk. You tell stories. But in my case, it's the, it's the videos, the messages. And the premiere is for every one of us in this camp. Bring your friends. Others will see and join. And you can talk with each other in the chat room. See how each other is doing. Say hi to everyone. Someone have an issue, we try to help them to work it out. And the bad weeds that come in, we try to help them to realize the truth of this journey, to see their place, to help themselves to figure out, to be focused enough to figure out is this the right camp for me? Is this journey for me? Am I truly a twin flame? So that's why I premiere all my messages. So you guys can have somewhere to talk with your soul family. Because only us twin flames will understand what we are going through. The things that we are facing. Our emotions, the passion that we have for ourselves and for our person. No one else will understand. So I premiere all my videos so you can have somewhere to chat with each other. Get familiar with each other. So that we can pray together. We can agree together. And ask God to bless us all together. Now let us pray guys. You can pray for whatever it is that you wish. Just make sure that you're giving God thanks. And thanks for everything. Not just the good times or the good things. The good times and the bad times. Because it's through our bad times that we learn who we truly, who we truly are. 
It's through the bad times that we get stronger and closer to God. Because it's through those times we realize that we can't handle everything on our own. And therefore we have to turn to God. And God will deliver us from those negative times. And if you do not know what to say when you're praying, because if you're like me, guys, sometimes, well, all the time, I, I don't even know how to pray. I'm just being brave and doing this for you guys, for God's people. Because this is my mission. To lead God's people, to help God's people. To focus on Him. To be back into His presence. To realize that this twin flame journey is about you, God, and your masculine. It's not about you and your masculine. It's about finding God so He can be placed in the middle of your connection. When you start to focus on God, you realize how easy things start to get. You realize how easy it is to let go off of your masculine. If I mask things when you find God, when you start to focus on God, you realize how easy it is to decipher the good from the bad, to figure out those who are against you and those who are with you. You find out how easy it is to let go off of those people, things, jobs that you have been holding on to, that you didn't want to let go off of, because you thought those things were your end all be all. When you start to find God and acknowledge God in your life, God will open your eyes and help you to see the truth. The truth of the people surrounding you, the truth of the situation you're in. So you too will be putting the God within you and your feminine in the middle. Because God is the glue that holds everything up. And if there's no God, then things will be falling apart. And that's exactly how you know a karmic relationship from your twin flame relationship. Because things will be falling apart, divine masculines. And you're going to try to put it back together so hard. And each time you try to put it back together, it's going to fall apart. And the only person that is all left there in your troubled times the only person that when they send you a message, it makes you smile. The only person that will give you everything even when you push them away. Your Divine Feminine. Because you both are connected through God. You both know what true love is. You both understand what love is. You both have unconditional love for each other. You both are connected to God. Now what I always tell you guys to do. Pretend like you're in the room with everybody right now. Pretend you're holding hands. And we're praying together around our bonfire. Giving God thanks for everything that he's ever done for us. Let us pray, everyone. Dear Father, O oh God, as we come before you today, we want to thank you for life. We want to thank you for our family. We want to thank you for this soul family. I want to thank you for giving me the chance to create this camp so we can come together to worship you, to praise you, to give you thanks. And the place to receive your messages, your guidance, so we are not lost anymore. You are always here for us. Father God, you are protecting us even when we don't even know it. Through our bad times, our sad times, we are asking where you are. Where are you? Why aren't you here? But we don't realize that it's because you are busy making a path for us to get out of the negative situation. You are busy keeping us strong. 
You are busy holding us high. You are busy carrying us. And I want to thank you for being there even when we think you are not. I want to thank you for being in our lives even when we doubt you. I want to thank you for never giving up on us. Father God, I'm thanking you here for life, everyone here. As we come together, we agree together for you to continue to bless us, for you to continue to guide us, for you to continue to protect us, for you to continue to get through our situations, our sicknesses, for you to continue to show us the right road to take. So we are never lost. Father God, it's a pleasure serving you as a twin flame. It's a pleasure being a twin flame. It's a pleasure being an angel. It's a pleasure being a spiritual guide. It's a pleasure being in your presence. It is an honor knowing that I am a twin flame. Knowing that we were chosen to work on your behalf. Knowing that we are held high. Knowing that we are serving you. Knowing that we are leading people back to you. 434. Father God, I want to thank you for this guidance. I want to thank you. For making me a twin flame. I want to thank you for the chance. To make over my life. For the chance to be a brand new person. For the chance to feel real, true, unconditional love. Because we have been searching for this love all our lives. We try to find it in our relationship. We try to find it in a man, in a woman, in our parents, in our children, our sib siblings, our friends. We try to be accepted by others. And all of those fail. And this twin flame journey has taught us that the love that we have looking that we are looking for out there in a man, in a woman, in our friends, in our family members, in our boss, the appreciation we are looking for. It's already within us. And we have to first appreciate ourselves before we can see that true love, that true appreciation that you have for us. This journey has taught us to realize that we don't need anybody else to stand on our own two feet. Because when we stand, you are holding us up. The only person we need in our lives to guide us, to protect us, to love us, to care for us is you. Our masculines, our feminines, they are just our reward for putting in the effort to change, to take ourselves back to our spiritual being, to that guide that you sent here on earth, to that protector that you sent here on earth, to that caring person that you sent here on earth. To do your will. Help us to understand. That it's your will that will always prevail. And that. When we choose free will. We will always pay for it. And the reward is never good. Help us to understand that it's your will that will always prevail. And in doing your will, 
It's only then that we are rewarded. Help us to realize that this journey is teaching us to stand on our own two feet, to love ourselves, Help us to realize that this journey is about bringing ourselves back to you. Help us to realize that the Divine Masculine and the Divine Feminine is within us. Help us to realize that we cannot say we are divine unless you are within us. Help us all to see the truth on this journey within our connection. Help the Divine Masculines to wake up and see the truth. Help them to heal from their childhood wounds. Help them to heal so that they learn to love again. Keep them covered in your blood, God. Protect them. Be there for them. Keeping them strong, holding them high when they're going through their struggles, when they're facing those deceptions, when they're facing those negative people. Stand by their side, dear God, and give them your power to fight those battles. As you keep your divine feminine strong and always in a positive energy, help us to fight when those negative energies come along. So that we keep you in our heart. Help us to love like no other. Help us to give love like no other. Because in doing so, we're not doing it for ourselves. We're not helping ourselves, but we're helping others. Most importantly, we're helping our masculines to remain safe. <laughs> Thank you, God, for everything that you've ever done for us. God. 1717 we love you and we give you thanks and as you taught us to pray our father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thine will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil for thine is the kingdom the power and the glory forever and ever Amen. Thank you all for being here. Whether you're watching this at the premiere or afterwards, thank you all for your support. Thank you for supporting the Twin D camp. Thank you for being a part of the camp. Thank you guys. And I love you all. It's 606. <laughs> Take care of yourselves, everyone. Let's always remember to give God thanks. We're always asking. But let's also remember to give God thanks. Let go and let God everyone. Later.